A stable and reliable internet connection is essential for various activities, from work to entertainment. However, sometimes you may notice laptop is connected to Wi-Fi, but no internet access in Windows 11. You may be unable to visit web pages or download apps and games. The common reasons why Wi-Fi is connected but no internet is misconfigured network settings and problems with wireless routers. However, issues with DNS servers or corrupted DNS cache, outdated network drivers or problems with your internet service provider may also result in temporary loss of internet access. Whatever the reason, here is how to troubleshoot and resolve this problem and restore Wi-Fi internet access on your laptop. Sometimes, a simple restart can clear temporary glitches and refresh the connectivity, which often resolves the issue. Power cycling your router and computer allows them to re-establish their connection to the network and reset any temporary configurations that may be causing the problem. Let's first unplug the power cord from your router or modem, wait for a few seconds, and plug it back in. At the same time, restart your Windows 11 device and then reconnect to the Wi-Fi network. Resetting TCP IP stack is another effective way to eliminate any network configuration issues and refresh the network settings on your computer. This process restores the TCP IP protocol stack to its default state, resolving any inconsistencies or corruption that may have occurred. It can be especially useful if you are experiencing difficulties with IP address assignment, DNS resolution, or network connectivity issues that persist despite other troubleshooting attempts. Open the command prompt with administrative privilege and run the commands displayed on your screen. These commands reset the Winsock catalog, restore IP settings to default, clear the DNS resolver cache. Additionally, releases IP configurations for all network adapters, and requests new configurations from the DHCP server. After executing these commands, restart your computer to apply the changes and check the Wi-Fi internet status. If resetting TCP IP stack didn't fix the problem, resetting network settings through Windows settings can clear any problematic configurations and restore connectivity. This option reinstates network components to their original settings, including network adapters, protocols, and related services. It's a comprehensive solution for addressing complex network issues caused by misconfigurations or conflicts. However, Keep in mind that this action will remove any custom network settings and require you to reconfigure your network connections afterward. DNS, Domain Name System, translates domain names into IP addresses, allowing devices to locate resources on the Internet. Using Google's DNS servers can provide faster and more reliable DNS resolution, potentially resolving connectivity problems caused by DNS issues with the ISPS servers. Open Network Connections, right-click on Wi-Fi Adapter Select Properties. Double-click on Internet Protocol version 4 to open its properties and set Google Open DNS for the preferred DNS server and alternate DNS server. Click OK to save the changes. Now check if the Internet access is restored on your PC. Ensure a strong Wi-Fi signal for better connectivity. Weak signals can lead to connection issues. The strength of your Wi-Fi signal directly affects the quality and stability of your internet connection. Factors such as distance from the router, physical obstacles, and interference from other devices can weaken the signal and degrade performance. If possible, take your laptop closer to the router or use a wired connection for better internet connectivity. Also if you are connected to VPN server, disconnect it and check if the internet connection is restored. Additionally, ensure that your VPN or proxy settings are correctly configured and compatible with your network environment to prevent future connectivity issues. Device drivers serve as the interface between your hardware and operating system, facilitating communication and enabling functionality. Outdated or incompatible Wi-Fi adapter drivers can result in erratic behavior, including intermittent disconnections, slow speeds, or inability to connect to networks. Updating Wi-Fi driver ensures that your Wi-Fi adapter operates optimally and remains compatible with the latest network standards and protocols. Microsoft includes plenty of troubleshooting tools with Windows 11 that you can use to fix minor problems and keep your computer running smoothly. There is a network troubleshooter that checks problems with the network adapter and its related driver, and the internet troubleshooter automatically detects incorrect internet configurations and tries to fix them for you.
Wi-Fi power management features, designed to conserve energy by reducing the power consumption of the Wi-Fi adapter during periods of inactivity, can sometimes interfere with network connectivity. Disabling power management for the Wi-Fi adapter ensures that it remains active and maintains a consistent connection to the wireless network, especially in scenarios where the device enters sleep mode or low power states. If all else fails, contacting your ISP is essential to check for network outages or issues on their end. Internet service providers are responsible for maintaining the infrastructure and connectivity that enable internet access for their customers. Network outages, maintenance activities, equipment failures, or service disruptions can occur unexpectedly, affecting connectivity for multiple users in a given area. By contacting your ISPS support team or checking their service status updates, you can verify whether the issue is localized to your connection or part of a broader network problem. Additionally, your ISP may offer troubleshooting assistance or schedule technician visits to address connectivity issues and restore service promptly.